What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt Deville with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Adam Smith. Adam Smith, of course, with which was currently with Sky Sports. He states that he is concerned for Anthony Joshua. He states that Anthony Joshua needs rest and definitely he should not take on an immediate rematch with Danny Dubois. And let me counterpunch. Um, I think um, Adam Smith knows Anthony Joshua better than others. And I think that, you know, some people are more uh, cautious and more um, caring uh, for a protective, uh, for fighters. And Adam Smith is one of those guys, needless to say, is he wrong? I don't think that he's necessarily wrong at all. Uh, because if we look at other situations, you guys remember when Juan Manuel Marquez knocked out Manny Pacquiao? Pacquiao didn't fight for a whole year. Pacquiao took his time and from 2012, December of 2012, he didn't come back until 11 months later, which was in November of 2013. Okay, I think it was the 23rd of the third, the 23rd of November exactly. You know when he fought um, um, Chris Algieri. So you know he took his time and got himself right, had another child, and all that stuff. You know he healed, he rested, he recouped, he regrouped. Right. So he did that. And I think that's what, you know, Adam Smith is wanting AJ to do. Should he do that? Of course he should do that. I agree with Adam Smith. But at the same time, the ego, the pressure, the demand, OK, the expectation that's not going to allow Anthony Joshua to sit around for a year. If AJ doesn't fight within a year, people will forget about AJ. That's boxing these days. Heavyweight boxing. Joe Joyce last year was the shh. Now he's not. Now he's just shh. <laughs> right? So I, I don't really think, honestly, that he, he doesn't, uh, I don't think he has the time for that. You know, but it also shows me that Adam Smith is someone that actually uh, is legitimately concerned with Anthony Joshua. You see what I mean? He needs rest. He doesn't need to go back into a rematch. The proper things must happen. You don't rush anything. That's what Adam Smith's saying. Okay. And I think, and I agree with him. I think if people really cared for AJ, honestly, they wouldn't allow him to even follow his own ego back into something that he may not be ready for. Better safe than sorry in a lot of situations. But, you know, for everything else, because of the publicity, because of the outcome of the last fight, you know, a lot of people are pushing Anthony Joshua back into a fight. And, and, and probably he knows that. He feels the pressure. I think AJ always felt the pressure of what is expected of him. So, yes, he's going to go back into that rematch. As no, uh, he's not going to do anything of the sort because if he was to take the advice of Adam, that conveyed that maybe Danny Dubois put damage on him that other people don't know about. Okay, which I have a huge video coming about that pretty soon. But still, understand that. You know, he's not going to want people to think that he took such a bad loss that it affected him to take that time off. He doesn't want people to know that. That's all because of bravado, ego, and straight up reputation. AJ ain't going to want that and it ain't going to happen. I'm just going to be real with you. Uh, you know what I mean? He's just going to go in there and fight, win, lose, or draw against Daniel Dubois. And if he gets knocked out again, then guess what people are going to do? We're going to look at what Adam Smith said and others that were concerned that said, hell no, no rematch will go, right? And then they're going to pay attention and look in hindsight of, hey, maybe those guys were right. But you guys tell me what you think of Adam Smith stating that AJ, I'm concerned with him. He needs rest and he should not go back into a rematch. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunched. Peace.